Inuo is mystical surrealism with trippy imagery. Tomona is a blind Biwa priest who is haunted by a ghost of his dead father. And this isn't the most unusual thing in the movie. Inuo is mystical surrealism with trippy imagery set with memorable songs. Tomona's life changes when he meets the titular Inuo thought that he isn't Inuo's name at the time. Instead, the other boy says he was nameless. It's deformed with a gigantic right arm and he keeps his face covered by a mask. But the two of them make a good team when Tomona plays his biwa and sings. Inuo is able to dance to it. The more he dances, the more his body shape changes until he is just wearing a mask to cover the mystery of his face. The two became something of rock stars, but with great success comes jealous, greedy, and cruel people that they have to watch out when someone tries to sabotage them. The movie takes place hundreds of years ago in Japan, and it mixes both old and modern sensibility. You hear the old, traditional Japanese instruments being played, but there are also times when rock music seeps in. The period piece costumes are amazing in their grace and detail, and the animation is astonishing. There are scenes like one with clouds moving across the moon, or the water reflecting dust, that look as if they were cold be real. What stands out most in Inuo Drunk is a dreamlike nature. This is surrealism put in anime, and it can be interpreted different ways. The art group matches the bondless imagination of director Masaaki Yawasa to really make it come alive. It's not always clear what's going on, but the art group is constantly stunning. The music with its mix of old and modern also goes well with the story. Inuo is your, isn't your typical movie formula. It's like being weird different which will be for everyone, but it, like its protagonist, it shines and catches your attention as it tries something new. Inuo is based on a novel by the same name and is being released in theaters August 12th.